Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of No Man's Sky. Alrighty, when we left off, we were, ah, uh, well, <laughs> getting some of the missions done for our scientists and other base people, and also, in the time between last episode and this, our fleet has come back. So, let's see what's uh, going on. What we got from our fleet. Bromide salt. That's a lot of it. A lot of Viking effigies. A lot of antimatter. A lot of units. A lot of organic catalysts. A lot of units. A lot more Viking effigies. A lot more units. And a lot more units. And some iridescite. Hmm. That isn't too bad. Now I'm sitting at 2.4 million. Okay. All right, we're doing good. We're doing good. We're doing about as good as I could hope, considering. That alone brought in <laughs> one and a half mil. Oh, <laughs> okay. That was the wrong button. Uh, what I wanted to do was go to the freighter. Wow. <laughs> Storage is already full up. Dang. Uh, put that there, I guess? Do, unless I have another better spot for it. Don't think I do. So I guess we'll put it here? Since it would be with the antimatter housing? Yeah, sure, why not? Um, maybe right here instead. Yeah, right here should work. Um, put all the Viking effigies all... 14 of them in here. There we go. Uh, bromide salt. That actually actually would sell for pretty decent in a manufacturing system. Which I'm not sure if I'm in right now. I don't think I am. But I could be. Herein lies the problem. I don't know. Um, put that here. There we go. That's good. Um, hmm. Mm hmm. I think that's good for now. Does my really? I don't have any. <laughs> don't have anything in my hyperdrive. Well, I should probably fix that at some point. Uh, where did I put these? They go there. Okay, cool. All right, there's that. Um, put that. Uh, here. That's where that's supposed to go. Uh, the. That goes there. And. Geknip. Supposed to be right here. And. Oh, this is. Well, there we go. <laughs> there we go. We're doing great. Got bromide salt and unrefined pyrite, which are good for mining and manufacturing. And I uh, just need to find a place that'll let me offload it. That's the question now, isn't it? I don't know if this is one of those places, so I'm going to double check uh, with this freighter in which oh, it's produced locally. Crap. Well, so much for that. Um, hmm. Well, I guess the next thing we're supposed to be doing, or at least the next thing we should do, is more of the agricultural research, which is grow and harvest frost wart, which I think I got some last episode. I just need to plant it, is the majority of the issue here. Um, got some more of that. Might as well put that in its proper place, which is right here. Good. All right, and we got the frost crystal. Which is what we would need for frost wart. And I think I got dioxide, which would let that grow properly. Uh, I guess we'll put it here. Yeah, there we go. That's an idea. Uh, that's not the one I wanted. I want these things. There we go. Uh, put that there. Okay. And then. Trying to rotate it, but it doesn't actually work. <laughs> Put that there. And ta-da. There we go. 
Actually, since I'll need a lot of frost wart, I might as well just set up more. Right there. Whoop. And right there. Cool. And I don't think there's any more reason to try growing more. All right. So, with that done, I guess the next thing I should be doing is trying to get a new multi-tool. Because the one I currently have is not really going to help me in the grand scheme of things. That's the base I'm in. This is the space station. There we go. Just to make it quick, you know. Quick run over to the space station, see what they got in terms of multi-tools there. And if there's nothing good, go to the planets and do it that way. Damn, I'm on the wrong side. <laughs> it's over this way. Oh, my ship's over here. Cool. And there was no one else here. Well, that's to be expected. Whee! All right. Here we are. And... Oh! Herald of the Ancients, you say. Oh, it's a B-class, missing two slots out of a max of 24. I do like the color scheme. The question is, how much does it cost? More than I can afford, but I can't exchange the one I currently have. And I don't see why not. The only reason mine has a higher damage potential is because of the barrel ionizer, and I can just fix that. Actually, it's because this one has the bolt stir at all, and this one doesn't. I can fix that. No problems. Ha 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 ha! Beautiful. B E A beautiful. Alright, and I need to grab some more wiring looms, because I'm sure I'm going to need those. By the millions. We finish this thing up. And to be quite frank, I mean, come on. Come on. I, I pretty much got it made with this one. Herald of the Ancients. Man, oh man. The luck. <laughs> the absolute. <laughs> okay, I blew all my money. <laughs> I blew all my money on it. Well, um,. Hmm. <laughs> that, that puts a damper on the plan of getting more wiring looms now, don't it? <laughs> Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Alright, uh, starship. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Amplified cartridges. Oh, for the pulse spitter. Which I don't have. At least I don't think I do. Do I? Do I have it in it? <gasps> I do. I just need... Deuterium. <laughs> oh, man. And I have to go back to my frickin'. I'm going to have to go back. I'm going to have to go back to be able to make that work. I'm going to have to go back. Because I'm going to have to make that in a refiner. Oh, well. That's doable. And we can put that there, which is where it ought to be. Plasma launcher, we can put that there. Uh, but do I really need one? Charged with unstable plasma. It's a useful secondary, sure. Mm. Put that there. Actually, put this over here put this here. That way I can put this with this. Cool. Cool. Fantastic. And now put the secondary force field here. Ooh. Yeah. And now I can complete that and it'll stop telling me to do it. <laughs> what I wanted all this time. Alright, I can do the wire loom. 
I can do that part at least. Um, might as well install the optical drill here. Uh, makes me annoyed that I didn't <laughs> get any of these. I'm going to need to get more money before I can. Uh, I'm going to have to go back to my freighter. I'm going to have to go to back to my freighter. Either way, collect nanites to buy technology upgrades. Like what? Great abandoned buildings for nanites? Alright, well. I don't want to do that quite yet. I need to get into my freighter to finish off some of my other things I need to do. Okay. I'm not going to get aligned right. There we go. Wasn't going to get aligned quite the way I hoped, but it works. ships followed right after me I got flung the shit all right okay well that's not what I expected but okay <laughs> well those two fly off okay <laughs> that was a first for me all right Lung into the wall. <laughs> uh, boy. Okay, I should probably set up a new expedition just to make sure I get more money later. Because I have plenty of frigate fuel to make that happen. Hello. Last request. Difficulty rating. It's a balanced expedition. I'm pretty sure I can make this work. Hey, I can. As long as I use every ship available. <laughs> 900 tons. Oh boy, that's a lot. But, I should be able to take that. I am now down to, <laughs> down to four of these. I should craft some more. Just to be on the safe side. Good. And I'm sitting with 2,000 of tritium. And what is the other thing that was necessary for it? I forget. Uh, dihydrogen. I'm sitting at 2,000 dihydrogen. Okay, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good for a while. Okay. Fantastic. With that in mind, let us go and pull some of this out. There we go. That, I keep hitting the wrong button. Over and over again, I keep hitting the wrong button. But it's fine. Um, there we go. Put that here where it belongs. Put this here where it belongs. And we're good. I guess. Good enough. Okay. Um, where is my refiner? Where did I put that? Did I not put it down the refiner? Did I never put down a refiner? I guess I never did. Okay. Um, large refiner. Might as well do that now. And then do the different colors. Cool. Uh, even though it doesn't really change all that much. Uh, rotate. Okay. Not bad. And ta-da. There we go. And now to make the deuterium. Hmm. I don't really want to, but I don't have a choice in the matter now, do I? Okay. That's not what I want. I need the tritium next. There we go. And I don't need that much. Not even close. 
Not even close. I need, at most, 125. At most. And luckily, it won't take that long if I'm only getting that little. Which is, you know, ideal. Okay. I'm going to bring that down to 125. Perfect. Again. And that one takes about 30 seconds. All I needed was... Yeah, it was 125. Okay, I was right. <laughs> I was hoping I was right. <laughs> I wasn't sure. Uh, I was really hoping I was right. Um, bolt caster. That one's easy, actually. So is the blaze javelin. Now I think about it. Hmm. Uh, the bolt caster is probably the easiest. Out of all of them. But the pulse spitter is very nice, too. So I'm going to quick transfer that to my exosuit. And quick transfer that to my uh, starship. There we go. And quick transfer that to my suit. Make sure that all went where it was supposed to. Not really, but it's fine. I can fix it at least. Okay. And now to finish out that. And with the amplified cartridges, I get a whole lot more clip size, which is good. Because I didn't have much hope of the pulse spitter being good otherwise. Um, hmm. Barrel ionizer. Specifically for the bolt caster. Damn. I was hoping it would also technically work for the pulse spitter, but no, it don't. Oh, well. Um... comes to drain manipulation. I need to get that done. Oh, I need to make the hydrogen jelly. I hate having to make the hydrogen jelly. Okay. Okay, well, let's take dihydrogen, put it in there, and only make one, because that's all I need. I can't believe it takes a minute to make one. It takes so little time to make more <laughs> dihydrogen out of the jelly. I find that hilarious. Oh well. Um, still needing to make carbon nanotubes, so I might as well make a whole bunch of those. How many did I need? I need two for that. I put on the bolt caster, which I'm gonna. Hmm. I would need three for that. Okay. Luckily, I have a lot of chromatic metal. Okay. So, bring that to five. Whoops. Just shy of the right amount of button press for that that. Fantastic. And then do that. Perfect. And exosuit. Go back to this. Put, oops, put that away. And pick that up. And then put more carbon in there. Good. And finish out this. Cool. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we're good for now. Uh, okay. Well, I guess the next thing is then to, I guess, raid a planet. Nanite rich location detected. Raid an abandoned building time. 
technically detected it from inside my freighter. Capital ship. Alright, it looks like it's on Iguchi. Of course it is. Okay, I'm surprised at how much issue I'm having getting righted. Abandoned building. Let's go! What in the hell's bells is this? This is an anomaly that came out of nowhere. I have no idea what to think of this. A relic gate? What the hell is a relic gate? Um, where am I going? Being teleported far and away. Discovered by Sembo. Hepzing Lino system. Whoa. I'm sorry, I traveled how many light years? I traveled 335,000 light years? You're kidding. You're, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> I traveled so far away. Okay. Well, um, where? <laughs> where is my ship? Where is my freighter? Where is anything that used to be something that I was able to reach? Why? <laughs> where am I? Where is any of my stuff? <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess we'll go to the space station then. And, uh, get our bearings. <laughs> okay. And in we go. Wow. Literally nothing. <laughs> nothing is within visible... <laughs> ...visible reach. <laughs> Oh my god. I am on literally the other side of the galaxy. That's what I'm thinking. I'm on literally the opposite side of the entire galaxy. At least, hopefully. Oh, Harbinger of Vush... What was that? Vushkali 3. Oh, Harbinger of Vushkali 3. Alrighty. What are you? Uh, what are you? Uh, okay, then. Well, let's go for an exosuit upgrade. And I can't because I don't have the money. But I could go with technology. That's probably a good thing to do. I can afford it, anyway. Cool. Oh. Everything is in another galaxy. 
Well, I mean, I kind of can't control that. Wow, these ships are big. Wow, look at these. Oh, ain't these something? Look at that. The Forge of the Sun. That's a hell of a name. I kind of want to see what your... I kind of want to see what your ship is like. Forge of the Sun. Oh my... God, that looks so cool. It looks so cool. It's a better fighter than what I currently got, but I can't afford it. Uh, so good, though. So good. Oh, man. I want it. I want it. I hope to someday have it, but right now I can't afford it because I'm so poor. <laughs> okay. Um, well, this is where I am now, <laughs> I guess. All right. Uh, can I just teleport back? I probably can. Oh, it'd be nice if I can. Okay, good. I can. Uh, what is what emergency broadcast repeater? I don't know what that's about. Uh, what is... What is this current station? I have no idea what this current station is. I'm sure I'll find out if I get into my ship. I'm sure I'll find out. Hepzing Lino Station. Omega. Hepzing Lino. I gotta remember that name, because I gotta come out here again soon. One of these days. Hepzing Lino. And these ships are something. But not enough to keep me here. Away I go. Alright. So. Moon of Unknown Planet. Discovered by Simbo. It's a moon of an unknown planet. I mean, they didn't... They didn't finish? They didn't finish with all this? Interesting. A bountiful moon. Very interesting. Alright. This is an irradiated planet. Ooh. Let's notice this one. This is an unknown planet. It's also an irradiated planet. Magnetized ferrite, gamma root, copper, and uranium. Hmm. It's a moon of what? What could it, this massive freaking thing, be a moon of if it's not this? Oops! Ow! Well, at least I got a tritium hypercluster out of running into that. Okay. All right. I am so lost. <laughs> I'm so confused. Okay. It's a tropical planet. Okay. I'm I'm so baffled. I'm so far away from anything I ever knew. <laughs> uh so weird. It's so weird. Okay. You know what? You know what? I'm just gonna go back to the space station and do that. <laughs> I gotta I gotta do something. I got to do something <laughs> other than just sit here and go, wow, wow, wow the entire time. <laughs> Okay. So, I think the teleporter was over here, yes. Okay, hello. And back we go. <laughs> to 
<laughs> Nailing Station Sigma. Oh boy. But I do got to remember the name of that place. Mainly because I want to explore around that section of the galaxy a little bit more. If I have the opportunity to, anyway. Okay. And let's go ahead and go do that thing that I intended on doing a while back, which was the thing for the warrior, but also uh, that. So let's go ahead and do this thing. Well, I, I don't want anything to do with the freighters here. Not that I don't want new freighters, it's just I can't afford them. So there's no point. Why are all the freighters in the galaxy right here? Jesus. Get out of my way so I can at least fast travel, please. Come on. There we go. Finally. That was a hell of an anomaly that I found. A relic gate. Man. Traveled me to the other side of the freaking galaxy. Literally the opposite side. Okay. Land to begin search. Or... I can just search manually. Shouldn't be that hard. I noticed... One of these, so I'm gonna have to land anyway. Cause I wanna get, I want to get that thing. All right. Whoop! Well, that's not what I want. What I want is this. There we go. Beautiful. All right. Ooh, that's a drop. The question is, is there anything down there worthwhile? Oh. I'm pointing in the right direction for my thing. Hmm. Okay. Well, I pissed off an animal. But technically, this animal's always pissed off me, so... Come on. Finally! <laughs> about to say, this one's gonna be... A little bit more difficult to take down. And that guy is going to be just as ornery if I walk too close to him. So I'm going to stay over here and just mine. Mine away at the hy dihydrogen crystals. Oh, how could I ignore that, though? Okay. I don't end up pissing these guys off. Okay. Got some. Ooh, got four. Nice. And restore. Fantastic. And. Put back the mining beam. And where was the thing? That way. Alright. This is going to be a bit of a trek and a half. hydrogen crystals. How could I turn that down? The answer is I can't. Alright. Oh. Some of it was hidden by a rock. That's how it goes. There we go. Good. And that is... Okay. I know, I know, I know. It's over there. I get it. I don't have to keep telling me. Okay. And this will at least help me get there a little faster. Just until I get to this one. Whoop. I had a feeling that was going <laughs> to Alright. Well... More of these before I go ahead on my trip once again. 
using super jetpack power. <laughs> Why not, right? It's available right there. Why not abuse it? As long as it works, right? As long as it works. Alright. Up we go. Go again. Oh, that must be the abandoned building. Yep, I had a feeling. I'm gonna slowly descend and to die. Oh, I'm noticing some creature eggs over there. Ooh, forsaken <laughs> terminal. <laughs> forsaken terminal, huh? Hmm. I don't like the look or sound of that. Unknown sector. And thank you, Reggie, for blocking that out. I appreciate that. Is that what I think it is over there? Yes, it is. Sodium nitrate. Just gonna collect it from a distance, because why not? I think that's all of it. Maybe. Well, I'm not going to risk missing out on it. It's available. Oop, there is. There's a little left. There we go. And there is a... Oh. One of these. Hello. Get some carbon and oxygen from this. And this. And then just plain old oxygen from the other creature. There we go. That wasn't so hard. Alright. Not too shabby. I also noticed that there is some albumin pearls I can collect around here, and how could I turn that down with how much money that'll bring me? Oh, look at that! Oh, look at how many of these I could get. Oh, well, hello. Just gonna break you down slowly, just for the sake of safety. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm gonna keep getting these. Well, it's all empty. There we go. That's one. Okay, these are just cobalt, and these are just cobalt. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. And some more over here. And just one of you. Get you. And then get you. Don't know why it keeps accidentally doing a second humming sack opening whenever I do it with just holding the button down, but. I guess it kind of makes sense. I'm kind of curious if there's any more further along in here. The only way I'm going to find out is if I explore. Yes, I will get back to the building. I will get back to the building. Don't worry. I will eventually <laughs> do that. I just wanted to test my luck to see if I could get more money. And I will get more money. <laughs> There we go. Must always hunt to see if there is more ways to earn credits or more useful equipment so I can complete my mission faster. Or missions, depending on necessarily what I'm doing. Okay. I think 
That's all the luck I'm going to be trying today. So let's get back to that building. Huh? Oh, there's an easy way just to get above the caves. Cool. Alright. Then we get back over here. Ooh. Get these. Get the what? Get the... Oh, that's what that is. Gotcha. <laughs> I was wondering what the hell that noise was. Made no damn lick of sense. Okay, might as well get some nitrogen too while I'm here. I'll always need some. Not a lot, but some. And I'm turning this down while I have the opportunity. It strikes me now, I should double check. Uh, oh yeah, I need to break open some of that. For sure. Uh, put this here, good. Um, I'll hold on to that, I guess. Put that in... Special out of range. Damn it! <laughs> I'll be over there soon enough, I guess. And put this in the freighter. Where do I put this? There we are. Good. Sometimes I forget where I put stuff. It's easy to. I mean, you know, I've been nursing a migraine since the last freaking episode you recorded. Oh, boy. Had a migraine for now days. Not a day, just days of. It's aggravating. Alright. Now that I am here in this very broken building. Oh days. Collect nanite to buy technology upgrades. Well I can do the collecting part. Okay. I guess I gotta pick up the residual goop if I want to do something with it. Returning user identified. Returning. Terminal now active. Unlocking data log continuation for analysis. I glimpsed the crimson orb between the clouds. A vast and baleful eye, unblinking and monstrous. Fear turned the blood in my veins to ice. I was so afraid it would see me. But then the clouds moved, and it was gone. I was no longer certain if it had ever been real. Perhaps the fungal deposits from the last world I visited are still clogging my exosuit vents, affecting my cognition somehow. I have cleaned my filters six times now, but I still feel it inside me. Whoa, dude. You got infected by a parasite, man. This is, this is the sort of thing that they make Star Trek episodes about. <laughs> Analyze data log. I discover something coded deep inside the long dead traveler's data log. Something has been left that will aid me on my own journey. Cool. Got nanites. And a microprocessor. From that, I'm assuming. Unless... I get something else. Projectile ammunition. Okay, so the microprocessor was from this. Okay, I have no idea. What else I'm doing? This is for restoring shields. Shield to maximum. Yeah, I figured. But it was still worth a shot. I'm gonna pick that up. Pick that up. Good. Alright. Well, we have done this thing. We did it well. Oh boy. <laughs> that's a... That's an image. <laughs> that is an image to walk out to. Just a creature standing on the edge of the crater, watching, waiting, <laughs> hungering. <laughs> I couldn't resist. Okay, summon it down here. Good. Locate a multi-tool technology merchant. I could do that. I could easily do that. Uh, but question is, I need to do the thing for the weapons research, dude. Find and interrogate the pirate. Where is he? He is on another planet entirely. Or he's on this planet. It looks like it anyway. Okay, we'll do that. And we'll put that in here. 
And then we will do something with the residual goop, but I don't know what it does. It does viscous fluids. So it turns junk into other junk. The question is, what does the viscous fluids do? Skin contact not advised. But I want to know what this does after it's done doing this. That is the question. Because most of this stuff I only just learned is a thing. So I'm kind of curious what it ends up becoming. Living slime. It's a heavy oozing slime. It is moving gently as if it had a heartbeat of its own. Uh, okay. That... Still not entirely sure if it was worth doing this. Okay. I'm going to get out of here. Head over to where that pirate is. Or at least start heading over in that direction. Oh, it'll take quite a few minutes. So, I might as well just end the episode here for right now. But first... Sounds like it's done here. Living slime becomes... Runaway mold. Okay. Out of control mold growth that builds up in poorly maintained machinery. Likely to be several different species of mold merged together into one super colony. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing, but it feels like I'm just wasting resources breaking all of this down into whatever it is. But, since I'm going to be taking a lot of time going to this pirate anyway, might as well do it. But, uh, yeah, might as well end the episode because we're over time anyway. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so it can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and I will see you all in the next episode. Damn, I was able to get that done pretty good. Nice. This has been the one the only Stray Cat. Playing games and exploring the galaxy in weird and wondrous ways, including a relic gate. That was something. And uh, now just getting back onto the track that I was supposed to be on, which was mainly doing missions for my base people and helping them further along, mainly so they can help me further along. Uh, will that happen soon? I don't know. But we'll... They'll keep trying for you.